Okay then, let's give it a go. Right, so we've we got Ben Tuck with us. How you doing? GT, BMW. Say no more, I think. Yeah, it's quite nice. <laughs> ben, if you, wanna, if you want to quickly introduce yourself, you know, where you're from, how you started, etc. Yeah, so as you said, I'm Ben Tuck, racing in GT4 this year in the BMW M4. Um, started off in car racing in Mazdas in 2014, and then did the full Mazda MX-5 Championship in 2015. Did caterums a year after that. Uh, did half a year of caterums in 2017 and then moved on to GTs uh, sort of the back end of last year and now this is my first full year in GTs as well so it's going well so far I'm really enjoying it yeah you've had a bit of variety haven't you yeah, I yeah it's, been, it's been quite interesting how did you find your rally cross yeah that was uh, <laughs> second corner first first flying lap for uh, Alton Park didn't go too well down Cascades <laughs> decided to go a little bit too wide yeah I won't be making that mistake again right something you might consider for you know you know, a sideline, you know, late one still again. Yeah, um, yeah, just see how it goes, to be honest with you. I'm just taking it lap by lap, you know, new yeah. car to learn, new team. But yeah, I'm, it's so far. Okay, um, your GT4 debut, Silverstone. Mm -hmm. It was a, a win, I believe, to start with. Yeah, so that was sort of midway through last year when I stopped doing caterums, did the GT Cup. That was in a GT4 Ginetta um, in Super Cup spec. Um, came into it in the weekend, you know, with the team, they'd never run the car before. It was just been sat in their workshop for a year, not even, they not even turned a wheel. Um, you know, we just turned up and to see how it goes. Qualified pretty well. Um, me and my teammate both qualified second for our races um, and both finished second in our sprint races. But then the joint endurance race the next day, um, yeah, managed to win it. So that was a, that was a good one. So it, um, but your GT3 debut at Brands. Yeah, not quite a <laughs> debut in the end. <laughs> uh, turned up, but I didn't get to drive it. Unfortunately, um, the car had a bit of a smash in practice before I got my go, but at least it meant I got to go at Donington at the next round instead. So I, yeah. still, I still did get to drive it at the end of the year. Well, yeah, not the same car, but the, the, the other one in the team. So your second debut at Donny. Yeah, exactly. Second <laughs> debut went a lot better. I actually drove it. <laughs> um, got, you know, most of the way into the race. Well, I say most of the way, about 15 minutes. Um, and unfortunately, the engine let go. So yeah, still a bit of mixed emotions for a, a debut in GT3. Didn't really get to complete the race, but yeah. you know, qualifying was fun. Getting to drive a GT3 flat out, you know, as far, well, flat out for me, as fast as I could. Yeah. Still good fun. Okay, and I understand you, uh, you like Spa as well. Yeah, it's my favorite track, definitely. <laughs> so I managed to get there even when I was racing back in Masters. So I've been there quite a few years in a row yeah. now. And every time I go there, it just gets better and better, you know, especially because I'm driving faster and faster cars every time. Yeah, tell us about the prototype. Yeah, so first time driving a prototype was at Spa. Um, yeah, really good fun. Obviously, it was similar conditions to this. It was absolutely chucking it down when I first got to drive it. So I was a bit, you know, a bit quiet at first, just got it yeah. round, um, went into qualifying again. That was wet as well. And then in the races, it managed to dry up a bit. So got good practice with those on slicks. Yeah. You know, Hurt my neck a bit going round. <laughs> <Quick. laughs> yeah, no, that was really good. And again, managed to win both those races that weekend with my teammates as well. So again, another debut win. So I can't complain with that. Silly question. Uh, I suppose GTs did your own. Mm -hmm. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing else no. in mind. No. Good. Yeah, GTs is the way I'm going. <laughs> Sorted. Um, and Century. Uh, quick word about Century. Yeah, great team. I worked with them when I drove the Genetta GT3 last year. Um, and then, you know, planning on doing something GT related this year and it ended up being the full season with them. And um, I wouldn't pick any other team, to be honest. They've just been great ever since I've worked with them. So Brilliant. yeah, really good Nice team. one. Um, okay then, so uh, we have our silly little partner. Yeah. Where we're going to ask you 10 questions. Okay. Hopefully in under a minute. Okay, I'll try. <laughs> and you just come back with your first answer. All right. As long as it's, uh, as long as it's PC. <laughs> I'll try. Okay, so here we go. Mm -hmm. Marry, taken or single? Single. Marmite? No. Uh, fried bread or toast on a full English breakfast? Toast. Your favourite colour? Purple. Rock, pop or rap? Oh. <sighs> Pop. <laughs> <laughs> if you could wedgie any historical figure, who would it be? Oh, if I could wedgie anyone? <laughs> I don't know, maybe Churchill, because that would get in the papers, wouldn't it? People would know you there. We've heard Hitler before. I, did, I was going to say Hitler, but I didn't, I didn't know if I could say it or not. <laughs> Name one thing you've done but would never do again. Um... 
I'd like to say drink too much, but that always seems to happen. I'm like, what about uni? <laughs> yeah, no, drink vodka. I'm not drinking that again. Okay. Three words you'd use to describe you. Uh, Three words only. Quick. Um, distracted right now with someone <laughs> behind you. Um, pretty happy. Good stuff. Do you have any tattoos? No, but I do want one. Oh, okay. good. Just don't. And know. name one thing you've learned this week. This week. Oh, I should have learned a lot of things at uni, <laughs> but have I? Uh, I've learned about coach and athlete relationships in uh, in a lecture that I went to this week. I'm sure that was thrilling. It's very interesting. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, and Ben. Well, on behalf of Tin Top Racing News and Views, we're proud to follow you. Cool. We Thank think you're going to go far. Have a great time, mate. Cheers, thank you.